hi construct a triangle xyz in which angle y equals 30 degree angle z equals 90 degree and xy plus yz plus zx equals 11 centimeter so in this particular construction problem what is given is in a triangle the perimeter has been given and two angles have been given so the triangle would look something like this where we have a 90 degree here you would have a 60 and a 30 degree in two places so this is basically how the triangle looks but the way to draw this is what we will look so the first step that you would do is draw a straight line x y plus y z plus z x equals 11 centimeter so take 11 centimeter and draw a straight line so this would be the 11 centimeter let us take this as two other points a b now at a let us take see this we have 30 degree and we have a 90 degree so at a let us draw a 30 degree angle the steps to construct i guess you already know this so i wouldn't be going into that so you would construct a 30 degree angle over here so this would be the 30 degree now once you construct the 30 degree angle then what you need to do is you need to draw a from the other side you need to draw a 90 degree because this, the angle z is being given as a 90 so at b let us draw a 90 degree angle now both at a and b we need to draw an angle bisector so an angle bisector is a line which divides the particular angle into two equal halves so 30 degree would be 15 and 15 so a line which goes like this and this is 15 degrees and here from b again an angle bisector so since the angle b is 90 the angle bisector would be 45 so something like this so the point where it meets would be the x point let's mark it as x now a x and b x we have these two lines now we need to draw the perpendicular bisector to a x so let's you have to use the use a compass and use the method of constructing a perpendicular bisector so i'm just roughly showing it to you how it will come so it comes and it uh, intersects a b at a particular point so this point would be the y so and similarly for x z you need to draw the perpendicular bisector so it will come and intersect a b at z now connect x y and xz you'll find that this is again you will get the 30 degree and here would be the 90 degree and uh, xy plus yz plus zx is actually it would it would be as we have seen it would be 11 centimeter that has been given in the problem that is the way you would construct this whole triangle now the construction steps steps i hope you will be able to write now i would like to tell you how to go about writing the justification so 
there are two things that we need to prove in this in this justification one is that justification what we need to show is that xy plus yz plus xz it is actually 11 centimeter that's what we need to show so for the first st statement that you would go about telling is that y lies on the bisector perpendicular bisector of bisector of ax since y lies on the perpendicular bisector of ax therefore a y is equal to x y similarly z lies on the perpendicular bisector of x b therefore a uh, sorry not a therefore b z is equal to z x okay now by construction we know that a b is equal to 11 centimeter that was the first step that we did so a b can be written as a y plus y z plus z b this is equal to 11 centimeter now a y equals x y let me mark this as 1 and 2 so from 1 and 2 1 and 2 what can we do 1 and 2 and this is 3 from 1 and 2 in 3 that is if I take a y this is equal to x y so instead of a y let me put it as x y plus y z keep the y z as it is plus z b or b z see this b z is nothing but z b and it is equal to z x z x equals 11 centimeter so this part of the perimeter thing that we have justified now the thing to prove is that angle x y z is 30 degree now let's uh, a in so let's do the second part in triangle let me write that in triangle a x y angle x a y equals 15 degree and since a y equals x y angle a x y is also equal to 15 degrees now angle x y z so angle x x y z equals see this is 15 and this is 15 so what happens here this angle is the exterior angle and it will be some of the two opposite interior angles so this is equal to 15 degrees plus 15 degrees this is equal to 30 degrees so we have proved that angle x y z is 30 degrees similarly similarly we can prove that x z y similarly we can prove we can prove x z y x z y equals 90 
degree okay so that i will leave it to you to write the steps similar way instead of taking triangle a x y you should take triangle x b z x and do the same b z x and do the same so now oh, once that is done it is clear that in this triangle x y z this the angle x y z is 30 degree and angle x z y is 90 degree hence it will be justified hope you understood if you have any doubts you can always message me